All right, so like we know, the Falcons had two back-to-back -back picks in the seventh round. I already talked to one of the guys, but now I'm here with the other, Javon Gwynn. How does it feel to be a Falcon? Um, it feels great. You know, when I got the call, um, you know, it's, it's unreal. Something you just dream about since um, I started playing football. And for her to get that call, especially from the Atlanta Falcons, it felt good. So this is a really special day for you, obviously, and you look like you're at home. Who are you celebrating this moment with? I'm in Charlotte, North Carolina, so I'm back at home. I'm here at my brother's house. I'm just celebrating with my whole family. Mom, dad's here, but all my brothers and sisters are here, grandparents and my fiance. That's so great. You're in North Carolina, but you played at the University of South Carolina. What was the experience like playing in the SEC? Um, you know, like the five years I was there um, in South Carolina, it was wonderful. You know, um, just the challenge, just the um, competition um, day in and day out, um, every single week, um, on the road, um, at home, um, just the competition um, aspect of everything. Like, it was, it was great. Let's talk about the actual draft, though. When you're at home and you get the call, you see the Atlanta area code, what were you feeling in the moment? Um, I don't know. I just seen it said um, Atlanta. I was just like, okay, like this could be my new home. You know what I mean? A home um, not too far from where I live now. So um, be close for my family and everything. So it felt good. So you talked about, about it's just close to your family and close to your home in Charlotte. What was your family's reaction when you hung up and you told them that you're going to Atlanta? Um, they were just joyful. Everybody was screaming. Um, my mom, um, she started crying, so, you know, like, I might, I might have, I might have cried a little bit, but then, like, but it was great, like, the whole energy in the room, everything, um, everybody was proud. You're joining a very high-ranked offensive line. What excites you the most about joining this team? Um, just to come in and compete and learn, um, learn from the, um, people that have been there, the veterans that have already been there, um, it just, like I said, compete and learn and um, help this team out um, in any way I can. So what's special about you? What are you going to be able to bring to the Atlanta Falcons? Um, I'm willing to do anything to win. So I'm willing to do whatever they need me to do, um, play whatever position they need me to play. Um, I do um, – they don't have to worry about me on the field, off the field. Um, I get in the extra work. I put in the extra time. Um, if anybody ever needs anything from me, I'll be there for them. So that's what they're getting from me. Just a person that's willing to um, do anything for not only myself, but for my teammates and for the whole organization. I love that mentality. Last question I'm going to ask you, and then I'll let you get on your way to celebrate with your friends and family. I've asked everyone this that we've drafted. I want to know it from you, too. Off of the field, what's one thing that Falcons fans should know about you that they might not? Uh, I don't really know. I don't really do too much. Um, I, I mainly be at home. I've um, played a game mostly in my free time, so I'll just say video games. Okay, well, there you go. Game is on his mind all the time. Thank you so much for joining us. Congratulations. Appreciate you.